What's going on guys? I have a quick one for you today. If you're using an Xbox 360 receiver, a third party one, uh, that is not an original Microsoft branded one, and it's not working, all you have to do if you're on Windows 10 is go to your start menu and just type in device, and then select this first option here, device and printers, and then scroll down, right click on the unknown device, that is gonna be the receiver, go to properties, go to the hardware tab, Go to properties again, go to update driver, and then select browse my computer for driver software. Let me pick from a list, scroll all the way down, select Xbox 360 peripherals, click next, and you can scroll down and select one of these two Xbox 360 wireless receiver options. Click next on that, and when this comes up, just say yes, and then just close it out, close it out, Okay, and then you can see that now your receiver is recognized. Now, the only downside to these receivers is that if you do go ahead and unplug it from the current USB port that it is on, it will go back to an unknown device and you will have to do this all over again. But other than that, if you keep it on that USB port, uh, it should stick across reboots and shutdowns. But you can always double check here if your controller stops working just to make sure that it's still recognized. Otherwise, you would just do this process again. It only takes a minute and then you'll be back and good to go. All right, guys, so that is going to be it for this one. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to leave a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys on the next one.